The wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Liverpool, they take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It is Liverpool facing Real Madrid. Well, Derek, you just wonder what those players are thinking right now. Some will be nervous, some will be excited, and some may be anxious. But once that whistle blows, we're going to... This is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Trent Alexander-Arnold plays with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And the centrepiece of the attack today, Sadio Mane. Alexander-Arnold. And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. And into the book he goes too. Well, once he gave the penalty, he was always going to give him a yellow card. This to open the scoring here. And the penalty is converted. A goal it is. And now he can exhale. Well, let's take another look. He chooses the right way to dive, but it's a good penalty because it's the height that beats him as it goes above him. Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Vinicius Junior. Casemiro. Rodrigo. On to Benzema. And Modric carries it forward. Let's see what he does next. Oh, a good diving save. for the short corner splendid defending and it needed to be not messing around with that clearance Thiago Salah an alert intervention Vinicius Junior Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly, and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. So, in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. the offensive 
The shots are. Alexander Arnold. And Mane in the thick of things. And pushed onto the woodwork. No nonsense clearance. Well, the keeper's made a good save, but you just sense a goal is coming soon. Liverpool couldn't keep it. And giving it away. Thiago. Excellent vision. Well, he hits it with authority. Close. Benzema. Modric. Now with Benzema. Tony Kroos. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Lucas Vasquez. Benzema hovering far post. And it still could be dangerous. And problem solved for now. Real Madrid have given it away. Good visualisation and execution. Speculative effort here. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. He could pick out a teammate. And he's clear his lines. David Alaba Mendy now can they make something happen but ultimately up a cul-de-sac an important interception Andrew Robertson Alexander Arnold. Alexander Arnold. And a goal to put them in front. Real drama here. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end is made to look so easy it's a lovely goal so back underway intriguing contest this given the 2-1 scoreline Vinicius Junior. It needs an accurate cross, but defensive efficiency there. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. There are so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. So, one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. And so the half-time whistle has gone here at the Parc des Princes in Paris. 45 minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Salah. Now with Konate. A bit sloppy in possession. Options in the centre. Lucas Vasquez, now with Benzema. Well, they keep passing away. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Can they square the game? And denied by the keeper. Impressive.
winning it back. Well, they might be onto something. And just over the bar, really good effort. Substitution for Real Madrid. Salah now and whipped into the box well no problems defensively well as you can see Real Madrid have controlled the possession but they've shown a real lack of invention today one or two of their more talented players need to step up now to get them back into this game Lucas Vasquez ready at the back post as Karim Benzema couldn't grab hold of it I think the threat has been averted. Salah. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like this. This could square the game. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Possibilities inside the box. Benzema! Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Delivering it. Able to close down the shot. Roberto Firmino. On to Conate. Mane. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. A trophy coming their way, surely. Here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. So the ball is moving again. They've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. And a throw-in it's going to be. Tiago. Salah. Fabinho now. Alexander Arnold, perfect example of how to execute a slide tackle. Liverpool in a position of menace. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Well, nearly at full time, not quite. And it's all going Liverpool's way, Stuart. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game... Oh, the chance is on, Stuart. And there it is! Still life left in this game. And they have the momentum now. Well, here it is again. The pass behind the defence is absolutely perfect. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal.
possession then, and Real can now entertain thoughts of perhaps pulling level. Just ten minutes to go. Alexander Arnold. Possession and patience, the watchwords. A very effective challenge put in. Good bit of pressing. Might be a chance here. Brilliant, crisp and clean tackle. Can they survive? Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Federico Valverde. Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. Mane. Firmino. In it goes! And surely that's the end of the story. They cannot throw it away from here. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace and transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. scoreline 4-2 and three minutes will be added on for stoppages he's in control Aidan Azar will dealt with that ball comfortably how about this England's most successful European club have done it again Liverpool the winners of the Champions League well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The kings of European club football, Liverpool. Well, this is what they wanted. often does it these will be photos to cherish for years to come brilliant stuff and you are looking at the best club side in europe